What's going on, y'all? This is Travis from Chasing Anthems coming at you guys with another reaction video. Now, we've seen the good. We've seen the not so good. Today, we're going to look at the ugly. I hate going there, but you know what? It's just right for the picking. There's just too many of these videos out there that we need to comment on. So today, we're going to be checking out Guitar Fails, specifically artists who are at the top of their game in that whatever space that may be. However, they decided to pick up a guitar and they entered the zone where it's our job to now, you know, let them know how we feel about it. So with that being said, if you are new to the channel today, thank you guys so much for tuning in, checking us out. Please uh, consider subscribing, like, comment, share, do all that kind of good stuff. And when we get done with this video, go check out some of our original music by hitting the channel icon or going to any of our social media links uh, in the description below. But watch this video first. And then go check out some of our original stuff. We got a new single coming out. It's called Santa Cruz. It's going to be out on all streaming platforms here, hopefully, any day now. So you're going to want to subscribe so you don't miss out. So with that being said, I guess we're just going to have to get into these videos. So the first one we're going to check out is no other than Lil Wayne. Now, Lil Wayne, if you don't know anything about rap, you know, he's one of the those top-tier rap artists. Uh, I believe he holds the record or claims to hold the record for writing the most rap songs uh, i don't know if he's produced or released them all but that's just what i'm told but for whatever reason he got it in his head or someone told him that he should pick up a guitar because that would enhance his game um let's check out and see what we think <laughs> I don't really knew what I was going to expect, but is it the worst? It ain't good. We'll put it that way. But, I mean, one thing we do talk about on this channel a lot is that, you know, playing music is all about having fun. And when you look at that face, man, I mean, I think he thinks he's doing a good time, you know, doing well and having a good time. So, I mean... At the end of the day, uh, you know, I'm not going to fault him for, you know, wanting to pick up a guitar and think he looks cool. However, if you are on a major platform and people are looking at you as one of the greatest in your lane, I'm not sure that really helps your credibility much. But I'm going to leave that up to him. But I'm going to recommend I think we better scour the interwebs for more guitar lessons if this is going to be in your future as far as... Um, you know, adding this to your repertoire. But, hey, to each their own. All right. That leads us to our next one, Nick Jonas. Now, I mean, the Jonas Brothers might not be your cup of tea, but, you know, as a as a brother boy band, you know, they've, they've seen their fair share of success. This, however, should have never happened. Roll the film. I mean, I mean, what, what, what can you say, man? They had the perfect opportunity here with the camera to his back to just play the backing track. He, he didn't need to go there. We didn't need to prove that he actually was playing. So many of these artists phone this in anyways. Um, but no. They they had to go in and and let him do his thing and this is what happened unfortunately. Now I will give him credit. He quickly bails on that once he realizes that this ain't going the way it, and he runs over to do what he does and that's sing. You know what I mean? And he's got a good voice and all that kind of good stuff. But I don't know why they thought that this was a good idea, putting a live guitar in his hands and letting him try to figure it out on stage. Uh, I'm sure you won't be seeing that in the near future. All right, this next video, I've never seen this one. This one's Madonna. Um, I'm not a Madonna fan. I'm just going to be straight out the gate. But I cannot wait to hear what she does with the guitar. <laughs> I'm good. Eh, cut. 
some things just should be not seen and that cannot be unseen. So next. Uh, next up, we got Lars. Classic stay in your lane. Lars, and we're ostracizing a lot of our subs here because I know a lot of people had subscribed after we uh, did the Metallica videos and stuff like that, which I'm greatly appreciate. However, some people just need to stay in their lane. And uh, this is a prime example. For someone that's got as good as rhythm as he does, that is the worst rhythm on the guitar from anybody that I've ever heard, you know, especially at that level, man. This is what you do for a living your own music. You, you're in the studio 24-7. We've all seen the videos. You've never picked up a guitar before, or at least to the point where you were confident enough to play in front of a, a stadium with 50,000 people. On the other hand, though, I'm going to give it to Kurt because Kurt is, is holding it down on the drums. Uh, and, you know, hey, he might have a, a side hustle opportunity. Uh, but Kurt, or I'm sorry, Lars... Stay in your lane, brother. Uh, I don't do not see uh, a guitar solo project uh, in your near future. So, so I'm sure if you've been watched, been on YouTube in the last several months, you've probably seen this video. And we're gonna end on this note because this has been painful. Uh, but for whatever reason, the Marley family donated DJ Khalid. I don't even really know him, to be honest with you, with one of their signature guitars. We are excited to share this new guitar with you. As someone who has an appreciation for Bob Marley's life and music, we want you to be one of the first to play the Gildy 20 Marley, based on Bob's at-home songwriting guitar. One of the first of all the musicians, keep that in mind, the Marley family wanted him to be one of the first to play their guitar. I guess you get what you pay for. Inspired songs that help unite the world, and we hope it gives you inspiration as well. <laughs> All right, that's enough. I can't handle it. No more. We're good. We're good. So, boys and girls, if you want to be an aspiring guitar player, it really doesn't take that much work. Get on YouTube, hire a guitar instructor. And you will be better than five or six of the, you know, top tier, highest earning artists out there. Practice, learn your chops, do your scales, do all that kind of good stuff. But do not follow in these guys' footsteps. With that being said, thank you guys so much for tuning in today on <coughs> the worst celebrity guitarist we can find on the interwebs. It was painful. It was rough, but we got through it together. Uh, if you have ideas for future videos, please leave the comments in below. With that being said, please subscribe, like, share, comment, and go check out some of our original music. Peace.